250,000 rands or 2 million rands? That is the question. Take 250,000 and leave your 1 in 8 chance of winning 2 million rands. How many of you will jump to that conclusion? How many of you will take the 250,000 rands with the whole possibility of the unknown? Remember, there is a saying, a bed at hand is better than 1,000 in the bush or something like that. So let me know in the comment section if you were in the same shoes as Liema, would you have taken that 250,000 rents or would you have stayed and continued in the game? Remember, we only have two more weeks, including this week, to go. So, would you have taken that 250,000 rents or would you still play the game? That is the question today. Guys, with this question, I welcome you to my YouTube channel. My name is Shooks. And this is Powerhouse of Positivity. If you are coming across my channel for the first time, please hit the subscribe button, like this video, and uh, let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section about the whole topic of today's video. And uh, watch this video till the last so you get the context of why I asked the question 250,000 rands or 2 million. Guys, I welcome you. Let's jump into the topic of today's video. So, Papa Ghost emerged the head of house for the second week running. This is his back-to-back -back winning. And uh, he is the second housemate to be able to achieve that kind of win. The first person to achieve it was Mark Jr. And now Papa Ghost has achieved it. Back-to-back -back head of house. And for his roommate for this week, he chose Z. Because they were the two people that competed in the finale. After the whole head of house game, Big Brother gave this housemate one hour to prepare for the whole nomination process. And guys, for this nomination process, Big Brother decided to bring back the fate room. Big Brother also removed the whole save and replaced for this week. So guys, without wasting much of your time, these are the list of housemates and how they nominated with their reasons for nominating. Magina nominated Willie and Mpumi. And his reason for nominating Willie is because he feels like Willie is giving him a weird energy in the house and uh, it doesn't sit well with him. And also for Mpumi, he feels like Mpumi has been disrespecting him since today and giving him bad energy. So for that, he's putting the both of them up for possible eviction. Next on the list, Mpumi nominated Snai and Liema. And, his, and her reason for nominating Snai is because she feels like Snai is a competitive person. After being uh, nominated for... Uh, back to back and he's still coming back in the house so for her Snai is a competitive person the next person on her list is liema and uh, for her she feels like with liema in the house that liema is a is a competition and a threat for her winning the whole two million rand. so to take out the competition is better liema leaves the house so that's why she's nominating liema the next person is papa ghost nominated mac jr as usual and willie the reason Papa Ghost gave why he's nominating Mac Jr. was a flimsy excuse because already we all know that he's nominating Mac Jr. because both of them don't like each other. But since Big Brother gave the instruction that you can't repeat the reasons week after week, he decided to become more creative and say that Mac Jr. uses the B word whenever he's talking to the ladies and that doesn't sit well with him. He doesn't appreciate that. And the next person he nominated was Willie. And his reason for nominating Willie is because Willie has been lucky. And he feels like if Willie is to stand up this week, that Willie will not survive it. And guys, we have to be honest. Willie should have been leaving the house yesterday. But because of the whole disqualification that happened to Elanda, that gave Willie an, another chance, another opportunity to last in that game one more week. So what uh, what papago said was actually true the next person to nominate is liama liama nominated z and mpumi and for mpumi she feels like mpumi is a competition in that house for her personally even though they are friends mpumi is a competition and for z now that papa that, and for z now that young papi is out of the house she wants to see z's real personality if she is to be nominated so that's the reason why she is nominating Z. She wants to see Z's real 
personality. For Z, Z returned the whole nomination back to Liema and nominated Liema and Makeke. Her reason for nominating Liema is because she feels like Liema doesn't have any input whenever it comes to shows or wager presentation, thereby drawing this housemate back and uh, making them lose their wager whenever it comes to the housemate losing their wager. And for Makeke, he, she feels like Makeke is a good game player and also he is the only housemate that he has least or no connection to. So that's the reason for nominating Makeke. For Senaye, Senaye nominated Makeke and Mpumi. For his reason of nominating Makeke, he feels like Makeke haven't stood up for a very long time. And also last week he didn't stand up. So it's better for him to stand up. And this week being their last nomination is best that Makeke feels what it is to be up for possible eviction. For Mpumi, the reason he gave why he, nom why he nominated Mpumi is because Mpumi is fierce and a competition. And also Mpumi nominated him last week. Sorry. The reason why he nominated Mpumi is because he feels like Mpumi is fierce. And after Mpumi did her nomination, Mpumi gave her a look. And uh, with him and going with his guts, he felt like with that look, that, that look signifies that Mpumi nominated him. So he's returning the favor and also wants to nominate Mpumi. So for Makeke being the last person to nominate, Makeke nominated Mpumi and Willy. And the reason why he's nominating these two housemates is because this is his last shot at nomination and he wants to see this housemate up for possible eviction. So after everything, the housemates that are up for possible eviction are Willy was up for possible eviction, Mpumi was up for possible eviction. As Biggie was mentioning the names of housemates that were up for possible eviction, he decided, you know what, since this is the last week of uh, eviction, it's better that all of you except the head of house which is papa goes stand up and be in the list for possible eviction so big brother decided to put all these housemates up for possible eviction so after big brother put all these housemates up for possible eviction big brother decided to bring back the faith room so we already know how this faith room works this housemate will have to select marbles from a box from a white box and whoever chooses the red marble will go automatically to the faith room and inside the faith room, Big Brother will give rules of what the game the housemate will have to play. For this week's faith room, Big Brother put the check of 250,000 rands and a red button and a 60 and a 60 seconds countdown. So Yama being the housemate that shows the red marble, she decided, uh, Big Brother gave her the instruction that if she is to choose 250,000 rands, she is to press the red button within the 60 seconds that was allocated but mpumi didn't understand the information or didn't pay much attention to the rules of the game so when the countdown was going mpumi pressed the red button unbeknownst to her that pressing the red button signifies that she is taking the 250 rand. so with that pressing the button and from not understanding the rules of the game guys here again Mpumi did not understand the rules of the game. That was why she pressed the red button. If she had understood the rules of the game, she wouldn't have pressed the red button. So, in her mind, she's not happy with herself for pressing the red button. And uh, let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section, which led to the question I asked in the beginning of this video. If you were put in Liama's shoes, would you have chosen the 250,000 rands or would you have stayed in the game? and wait for the final day of the game remember there is this thing of the unknown and also a bed at hand so with this let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section and guys remember this is the last day of nomination after this week there will be no more nomination so if you want to see your favorite in the last seven or last x number that big brother is going to choose come sunday is better you head on to the voting area and start voting for your favorite housemate because at the end of this week you will be voting for the winner of the show so guys let me know what your thoughts are in uh, this week and also this shocker that we saw today will you choose the 250 000 or will you stay and play the game that is the question i'm leaving you guys with so i'll see you in the next one bye bye